All right, so Naruto to Boruto Storm Connections trailer was actually just dropped to us out of the blue, uh, just randomly at like what? What the time is it? Seven a.m. Um, just okay, sure. <laughs> no announcements, nothing about it. They just said, "Hey, here's a trailer about Baryan Mo Naruto and a new Sasuke Uchiha supporting Kage." Apparently. They're going to be joining as a new playable characters. For more information, check it out here. So we'll take a look there. Uh, this will probably tell us about um, the characters. I believe there's a character list, if I'm not mistaken, right? Uh, something in here, right? I think we could just take a look at her in a bit. But um, for now, we're going to look at this trailer that does show Baryan Mo Naruto and then Sasuke, right? So I'll, I'll play the trailer for y'all. And I guess on the side, I'll just be looking for the actual, um, like, Baryan Monarto and stuff, uh, information in here. Hopefully there should be extra information, but this is a cool trailer. I think it looks pretty polished, uh, compared to Storm 4 was, right? So I'll just, I'll just play it, right? <laughs> This jutsu is known as Kiri. With this clap of thunder, be gone. So that looks quite good, right? I think that the trailer looks pretty nice to see. No release date still as of now, but we do know that it is coming out this year in 2023. Um, so that's pretty good to see. I think that this trailer doesn't really show too much here, but it does show a good amount of things regarding Bar and Naruto. First and foremost, we know that he's going to be actually an awakening. So this is going to be, um, again, uh, you know, the Kunama Chakra mode. Uh, Naruto here, Casey of Naruto as Kage Naruto, obviously, right? And it seems like, you know, he has a new moveset, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, again, his awakening, again, primarily is going to be featured around Barrio Naruto. Obviously, this is a brand new moveset. It makes sense that it's timed because that's what, you know, happened in the series. Naruto only had Barrio mode for a few moments before he actually, you know, detransformed. And unfortunately, Kurama did die. A very, very sad moment in the series, right? Uh, but this is cool. I think that this, again, just looks like his standard um you know combo attack is neutral combo where he pushes back sasuke uh if i'm not mistaken right so that's pretty much it we didn't really see too much else there um so this looks to be again the starter of his combo and that looks to be his jutsu or it could be one of his special actions right where you touch the d-pound on the left side or the right side right uh, I, I would assume this could be his, uh, again, a jutsu or one of those special actions, right? Very, very interesting. Um, but again, nothing else that we know about Bari and Naruto and how his moveset actually works. So I guess we'll hopefully see more later. Then we have, again, support Kage, or what is it? Kage assist? Supporting Kage Sasuke. Uh, that's just the Boruto Sasuke, I guess, right? Again, he has some new combos as well um if i'm not mistaken again it's been a while since i played storm 4 i'll be completely honest but that's again his i guess i think that's a new jutsu as well and then he has a new ultimate with him so it looks very similar to the old ultimate starting off here but obviously as you see obviously ends up doing keating right there so that looks pretty cool um where the karen comes together and then just destroys the um planetary devastation right I, I think that looks cool. Uh, I, th I think that these movesets look nice. They look polished, right? Very expected of a Storm game. Um, unfortunately, just, again, just looking at this, again, I'm not really feeling like, you know, it's too different from Storm 4. It's more like of a Storm 4 update than it trying to be its own standalone game. And again, I think that's uh, something that a lot of people... Um, a lot of us were misunderstanding about how the game was going to be, even though Storm Connections 
it's not like, you know, a fresh, you know, brand new, fully redone game, kind of. Which makes sense. It's not like there was much to build off of Storm 4 anyways. From, like, you know, visual, you know, if we're being realistic. Uh, I think that Storm 4 looks great. This game does also look great. Now, I just, I do wish that there were more improvements or more distinctions that we could tell from, okay, what maybe gameplay aspects have they introduced to this game to make it different from Storm 4, if any at all. They're just being very, very, like, I, I don't know, secretive about the game a lot of the times. Like, you know, they could have probably dropped this. If they dropped, like, Barrio Naruto and then supporting Sasuke, when the game was announced, that would have made people a lot feel like a lot better. Like, why couldn't this just be at the end of the initial trailer? Because it's not like they showed anything about gameplay or anything about the story and stuff like that. But I guess they just wanted to save this for a later time. Now, we have one extra thing here. It says, plus, here's a sneak peek of the original special story mode with Boruto as the main character. What awaits Boruto as he faces down a kunai and an opposing red Susano? Uh, stay tuned for more details. I can actually took a look into the link here. There's like not any extra details from what we already knew. Um, again, if we take a look at news, there's no like new, no news, like, you know, uh, thing like this was the original announcement that we did have back in February, but there has nothing, you know, there has been nothing new added here. So uh, I guess we, again, we're just going to have to wait and see for that. Now, this is interesting though. This is obviously the original story mode that we did know about. They did announce about this, I believe on like uh, one of their Instagram pages or something like that where we were going to get an original story mode here It seems like there's gonna be a new Uchiha because this is a red Susano now uh, Besides like Itachi who had like a you know, like a orangish red Susano No one else really has a red Susano like that, right? Shishui, I believe he has his green Susano. Sasuke has his purple one Madara has his red one, uh, not red one, his blue one and we have this new red one in front of us so we don't know what character this is going to be uh, also Obito's was blue as well so this is likely just a brand new original character or something like that uh, this is a new Susano design this is a perfect Susano obviously very very intriguing how uh the like what's going to be introduced in this new story how they're going to move forward with it I'm assuming this new Chiha is going to be who's holding the kunai I don't know if it's like an actual Chiha or something like that like we'll see once the actual game is released I mean uh, it seems like, again, a lot of people are thinking it's going to be like a female Uchiha. Apparently, there's like some leaks or something about it. Uh, again, I'm not even like going to be thinking about leaks and stuff like that because I, I just think that uh, we haven't seen anything too reliable as of this moment. So that's why I guess I haven't been really reporting on leaks and stuff. But yeah, um, Baryon Mon images from the Japanese website. Here's his render. Okay, this is actually pretty good to see. So yeah, again, things look pretty clean right here. Here's his render. His render looks pretty cool. I, I think I like this render for sure. Barra Na Naruto is just cool. Right, right. He's just raw. No matter what, he, he's just raw, right? Now, I guess the Japanese website has some screenshots. I don't know if there's new information here. I'll let me let me take a look here real quick before we end the video if there's any other pieces of information we may have. So there's a Japanese website again that there was being talked about here. But again, here's the renders for Bar Naruto and then the Sasuke. Uh, makes a lot of sense. There's actually not any extra information there. It's just confirming, you know, Baryon Naruto, his voice actor. Uh, here's the HD screenshots that were shared here, but no extra pieces of information on these characters or story mode. But again, very, very cool to see uh, the original story mode kind of information there. This is, honestly, this low-key is a little more interesting, even, you could argue, than this. Probably not, no, I'm a liar, but like Sasuke... Like, uh, it's a bar in our tone, the most hype for. Then this is interesting. Then I think the Sasuke after that. Because, like, uh, do we, we really honestly need another Sasuke? I, again, uh, not that I'm surprised that we're getting another Sasuke. I mean, let's be real. They're going to add a new Naruto on Sasuke. This is Storm. This is CC2, guys. The, we're, we're not new to this. This is, like, the, what, the sixth installment of the Storm series let's be real <laughs> but um it, it, he was not needed but he still looks cool naruto looks cool i think this is a good little update piece of news definitely much much better than what the first piece of update was because we actually got 
new information. Thank goodness, right? But let me know what y'all think about Storm Connections. Again, I did make a second channel for this. Um, but for now, I'm going to be uploading this on my main channel. I just see what y'all thinking. But yeah, I'll catch you next time.